Happening tomorrow, President Donald Trump, several cabinet members, Governor Josh Shapiro, and CEOs from more than 60 tech companies will be at Carnegie Mellon for a summit. The summit is focusing on Pennsylvania and Pittsburgh's potential to spearhead the AI revolution. President Trump said in a recent interview, the event is going to open the eyes of a lot of people of what is about to be unleashed in Pennsylvania. We spoke with experts in AI and economic development who are attending the summit. They tell KDKA they're hoping the summit and a major economic announcement that will be made there will showcase what's being done in our region in the energy and AI space to bring more people and business to the area. President Trump and the world's top leaders in energy and artificial intelligence will gather for the Pennsylvania Energy and Innovation Summit. It's happening at Carnegie Mellon, the perfect venue for these topics. CMU has always been the place for machine learning and AI. And really, it, this is in some sense a, a recognition of all the value CMU has brought to, to AI. Director of CMU's machine learning department, Zico Coulter, oversees AI efforts at the university. He says this summit also highlights the influence Western PA has in this space. We are going to see a lot of growth in these new sectors of the economy. We're going to see a lot of growth when it comes to energy, when it comes to things like data centers f to power those new AI models that are being developed these days. Uh, Western Pennsylvania is a hub for this kind of this kind of work. Senator Dave McCormick organized the summit and is set to unveil $70 billion for artificial intelligence and energy development across the state. It'll include building data centers, which require lots of energy to power AI. Don Smith, the president of RIDC, whose mission is to drive economic development, says the investment will bring jobs and much more. But also then those buildings and jobs will create taxes, so it'll help the fiscal health of our municipalities. Uh, and really, we're talking about getting in in the early stages of uh, you know, the biggest wave of new industrial development uh, in a very long time. And so I, I think this bodes well for our ability to compete successfully in the AI economy. Smith says Western Pennsylvania is perfectly poised to lead the future of AI. It's the combination of energy. I mean, the, the whole AI revolution is driven by basically power, computational capacity, and then the talent. And, and we have those three things in abundance here. Coulter says as we see more companies develop in the region, it's going to encourage further investment. It's going to just make it easier and easier for future innovators, for future entrepreneurs to stay in the area, to build up companies in AI and other tech areas in the region because the talent, the, the, the rest of the ecosystem that's needed to support those companies are already going to be here. 